There we go. I may. Cat's hanging out with me today. Hi, how's it going? Hold on. Okay, that light is on. I was confused for a moment. Hi, how are you doing today? Uh, Shio the Oni? Not much. Uh, I'm doing all right. I just got done eating breakfast and my cat's trying to get my attention. What's she you, May? She trapped herself inside of my recording room. And now she's stuck here until I leave. But yeah, uh, I just got to G-Rank last night. Yesterday. Not last night. Uh, I was playing a little bit yesterday to get some of the uh, grinding out of the way just to get the armor upgraded. And, uh... Yeah, thanks. It was... Uh, it, it was a bit on the monumental side for me. The biggest issue was the Supremacy Teo. But I was focused on getting him... Hmm, excuse me. On getting him taken out. And, uh... I see you, May. And, uh... Ended up building an armor set mostly to deal with him. Um, I mean, the armor set worked for the Perea and the Black Rathian as well, but it was mostly to help deal with the Supremacy Tail. Uh, and like, after I was able to survive his attacks, he wasn't actually that bad. He was just really aggressive, hits really hard. Um, I'd argue the Perea was harder, but that's just a me standpoint. Like, once I was able to not get one shot by the Teostra, I was I was able to learn his moveset and deal with him accordingly. That wasn't too bad. Um, as far as today's game plan goes, hey Naj, you gonna lurk for a little while? Alright. Uh, as far as uh, today's game plan goes, uh... So I'm going to work on getting a variety of weapons for G-Rank. Uh, you're not even the G-Rank lady. You are. Let's see. Star Guide, Special... Uh, do you not follow the thing if I don't talk to you from Mezaporte? <clears throat> she was showing me what quests to do. To rank, to level up the armor. Maybe there's a time limit for how long she'll do that. Yeah, it looks like it. They're not advanced, or they're not events either. Gathering quests. Let's see, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna go back into the tavern. I like the music over there more. You know, I don't know if I should, like, grind out this armor to GX form. Or if I should just not worry about that. I don't know yet. I know on the gear acquisition quest, there was the, the Hermitar. I'll run him for a little while. Try to build his armor set. Uh, boxes right here. Turn this down just a little bit more. Louder than I was expecting. Hey, Val. Uh, it is the starting armor for G rank. Hey, Raditz. Um, 
Not too bad. What the? Hold up. Am I not? Could have sworn. Hold on. Easy test. Yeah, I am in. Okay. I guess that new dash attack is just from the uh, the drawn weapons run. Yeah, no, I like it. Still hits hard, still hurts, but manageable. I did. I took them out yesterday. Yeah, the biggest issue was the Teostra. Um, he, uh... Once I was able to not get one shot by him, learning his actual movement patterns wasn't too bad. Finally done grinding on Rise. So much molding later, you made it to AR 181. Is that still the cap, or did they increase it? Because I thought they increased it to like two something. They increased it to 220. Also, hey, Nosh. Yikes. 181 is what you need for mats right now. Fair, fair. Let's get back. <clears throat> You're here back. Still trying to get the hang of uh, Extreme Greatsword, but I'm gonna start making a variety of weapons now. Let's try to get another knockdown. He left. That wasn't too bad. Have I learned the parry? I have. I forgot about it, actually. I could have used it uh, a couple times in that little spat that I had with the Hermitar. Yeah, I figured out the parry uh, during the uh, quests that it gives you to upgrade this armor. But I was never actually able to pull off the counterattack. Block Slam is the best weapon. You mean that? Youch. Yeah, the, the, the parry is really fun whenever you get it off. Ow. Extreme great sword, good? Yes, very good. Naj, how often can you say you can sprint with a giant sword like this? Okay, there goes my health bar. I got a little bit cocky there. Pretty much all the extreme weapons are good. Yeah, there's like, there's a table uh, that shows you how good the weapons are with what styles. And extreme style is 
very usable for very for very much all styles. That was very good English there. 10 out of 10. You thought they were using hammer? Nope. Great sword. Can I block this? He was not close enough for me to try. I was hoping to get the block off. There's no slap in Frontier. I did the inputs for a roll forward slap, and it's not in Frontier. I forgot about that. just badly timed. You're grinding stones in Doka and Gacha. I mean, that's fair. Whatever you gotta do, homie. That was terrible timing. No Vespoid. Hello, May. Welcome back. Let's get out of the way. Or, no, he's leaving. Which area is he going to? Oh, he's not leaving. Thought he was leaving. Laptop equals Kurai stream. Phone equals Dokkan. Hotel. Travago. <laughs> that was a bad show. I mean, it was clever. Okay. Oh, you can, like, parry into parry. Nice. Hit me. I wanna I wanna use the parry. Okay. No that that was a pretty clever joke, honestly. I like it. Oh that's that's very handy. Mistimed it. Press the button too late. I'll get it figured out. Not having sky blue is messing with me now, but it's a uh, it's a downgrade I'm willing to take for the sake of progression. an interesting interaction. Homework equals unfinished, sleep schedule <laughs> equals life ruined, self-esteem low, body hurt, life a mess, hotel Travago. <laughs> you went full in on that, man. <laughs> There was no halting that bus. Now, as far as armor sets go, though, I think... I think I'm gonna just self-execution right there. Yes. You told yourself to stand against the wall. As far as gear goes... You're fixing your sleep schedule? So much better infinity better 
it's really nice whenever you have at least a consistent sleep schedule. Do I need guard up for that? I feel like I need guard up for that. You had a horrible day today. What happened? What happened, my guy? You want to talk about it? Stayed awake with your friend playing Left 4 Dead 2. And at 6, 6 a.m. you are hungry, you're gonna make a donut from scratch. Like, if you feel like garbage, trying to f try to fix your sleep schedule to make things a lot more bearable. Your dough turned into batter and you ran out of flour. Oh, no. Well, hey, if it turned into batter, why not, why not make so something that uses batter instead of dough? Like, I get, I get that you were trying to make a donut, but, you know. Wow! Wow. You got so pissed due to lack of sleep, you threw away the batter and washed the dishes and went to sleep. I wouldn't have even done that much. I would have just left it on the counter and went to sleep. <laughs> uh, I'm kind of mad. He knocked me out on the last hit. Whatever. I'm gonna have to start bringing a pickaxe again. I looked into some of the stuff I'd need for gear, and like some of uh, some of the bugs you get by mining, and that's weird to me. If you left it on the counter, you'd wake up to a spanking from your dad. I mean, that's fair. That's absolutely fair. You were taught that if you shit, you gotta wash it. I mean, that is fair. That is fair. Send all those to box. That was a silver crown. Alright, what, what do I need to make Hermitar armor? That's what I want to know. Your sister made a donut once. Her first try, it was freaking fluffy. The fluffy donuts are really good. G Urgent has been issued. I've been giving a G... What? I have an Urgent? When you try to make it, it turns into pancake batter. Look to see what she's doing. What's What's the urgent? How do I find the urgent? You're not messaging her at 6 a.m.? I mean, then go knock on her door. Ah! I see. Oh, I can't post those anyway. Okay, I'm not going to worry about it. She's 400 kilometers away. I right, let me knock on her door. Yeah, go do it. Just, just go get her input on it. It's not that big of a deal. You just work on the Navi since I've got the Lars armor. Yeah, like that. That's what I was doing, and uh, wanted to upgrade the G rank armor. Wait. Marking the task is what causes the quests to pull up, doesn't it? Uh, a bunch of quests that I can't take on. Yeah, it does. It does give me the recommended quests. Stuff like Miru and stuff like that. It's a quick search function. I see, I see. Dokkan servers are sluggish today. 
Yeah, like stuff like Miru and whatnot. I have to, I think the lowest GR one to post is GR82, and I just entered G rank yesterday. I'm, I'm not, not taking that on. Yeah, I was, I was looking for these two quests though, because I was going to work on upgrading this armor. And I couldn't find them. I didn't realize that uh, if I pin the, uh, the objective, it gives me, it takes me straight to the quests. That's very handy, actually. Bento is beyond the limits of something. Alright, instead of dodging out of moves, I should start sprinting out of moves. Getting used to, um... Getting used to, uh... Extreme style is going to take a bit. How much will Naj's intrusive thoughts went, went out today? So far, zero. But it'll change in a flash. Yeah, good point, good point. You're gonna go all the way over there and fall over, homie. You're at four to one. I'm assuming it's not in your favor. Can't believe Ruko Diora is your first wall in Frontier. That guy's that guy was a pain in the ass. Yeah, he he was a little on the difficult side starting out, but his fight's pretty easy to learn in the lower ranks. It's whenever you get to Goshu that it starts to pick up the pace. I feel like if you control yourself, you'll increase your discipline. If you don't, you get a good laugh. Yeah, that's pretty much how it goes. But no, uh, you'll have to get used to the Ruko Diora fight because all the armors in Go Rank require uh, Elder Dragon gems to make if you want to use the Tenrin buff. Um, the Goshu and the Tenrin buffs. And the only monster that gives you Elder Dragon gems is Ruko Diora in Go Rank. Yeah. Yeah, each piece requires an Elder Dragon gem for the Go armor. You can make it through without Go armor, but that's that's what I used. That's what Crimson recommended me. That's what I ended up going with. Where did... There he is. Ruko is very fun. The Rock is not. That is... I'm pinning that. True statements have never been said. Thank you, Streamlabs. Are you gonna hold still? No. Sandwich me, Dad. What? <laughs> really? Really, Naj. <laughs> Oh, that's a good one. <laughs> Man summons a whole Viserios. <laughs> oh, Sprint, please. Thank you. Go down already, Iodrome. 
You forgot the why. You need to type fast for it to be in the sandwich. Or what you could do is you could save it to your phone's clipboard. Or your computer's clipboard. Greatsword doesn't really work too well against the uh, drums, I'll be totally honest. You'll wait another half an hour. that shit. There we go. might make another weapon because great extreme great sword is fun but it doesn't seem like it's really all that good for the smaller faster monsters you've saved up a quote just a weight slab Not gonna lie, I do like this outfit. It's got mage vibes. Court wizard looks. Bro is a priest. Maybe, maybe. You're playing Frontier with a keyboard, but no mouse? I appreciate the effort, but I would rather not turn my hands into a pretzel. You do you, though. Nah, no, I, 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 I want to get better at Monster Hunter on keyboard and mouse. It's just that I have a cat, and she gets in the way of that too much. She will literally put her paw on my hand, and it messes with me so much. You're the holy god Zamasu. <laughs> Alright. Time to level the shit out of this armor. Alright. If I want to get better... In Monster Hunter with a mouse and keyboard, play Monster Hunter World. I mean, I will be on uh, Wednesday and Thursday. Although I'll be playing the Ice mod. And I will not be running keyboard and mouse because... No thank you. How, how do dual swords run? I'm gonna run these. Uh, can I level them at all? Uh, weapons. Twin fireflies. Beast blood, okay. I want to level them at least once or twice, so I'm gonna do that. You don't know about extreme dual blades? I am justice given form, I am the world, and have venerate the most noble, most splendid immortal, and supremely powerful god Zamasu. You know it can be nutty. Uh, I don't have the endpoints to buy the mats anyway. It's fine. Uh, I actually need to start taking pickaxes and bug nuts again. In all honesty. 
G whetstones, high speed whetstones, expert whetstones. Alright, uh, manage item set, save set here, yes. I'm not renaming it. Uh, equipment, swap out for these bad boys. And I've got to reset my decos. Oh, the sword didn't have any in it, so it's okay. Alright, what was in here? Status fencing? And what was the other one? Was it status resist? Naj. I mean, it is a very good declaration. I'll give you that much. I have 50 points of evasion? What the fuck? Hold on. What, what am I getting all that evasion for? From? Is it coming from survivability? It's coming from survivability. Okay, that makes more sense. Makes a whole lot more sense. Uh, Zamasu is a racist. 10 out of 10. Is he? Was Zamasu racist? I need status attack. Where is it at? Status resist. I've got both my status fencing decos in. If you're not God, he hates you. If you're immortal, you're an insect to him. I mean, fair enough. Very much so fair enough. <clears throat> uh, G decos. I can't make any anyway. I'm out of net points. Change equipment. Caravan. No. SR. Style. Extreme. SR skill. Let's do defense. Even if you're a god, Zamasu hates you. Zamasu only loves himself. Isn't that why Zamasu made a second version of himself? He just wants to commit zero extermination plan. Yeah. Definitely. Alright. If I recall correctly, I'm supposed to run this quest once per thing. Zamasu wishes for Goku's body. Does he? <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, that was the whole Goku Black thing. Yeah, I didn't watch that arc. Alright, so there's that. Naruto run. Rad. The English dub for DBS is funny. They call Goku Black, Black. I mean, yeah, but in English, you don't also, like, say the same name constantly. Alright, so that's like my Demon Dance thing. Right, and then I was supposed to be able to hold it to do 
whatever to uh, do this, it drains. It's demon mode, but it drains health instead. Yeah, yeah. Okay. We just Naruto run our way in. It's two separate Zamasus. I want to read that. It's two separate Zamasus. One is from the timeline with Goku. He steals his body with the Super Dragon Balls and he uses the ring to hop, hop timelines to Trunks' timeline and recruit the Zamasu from there. So when people defending the future realize it's not Goku Black, it's actually Goku, they said, don't shoot, he's not black. <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> that sounds so bad. Whoa, whoa! Okay, dual swords. Let's go. Let me get out of demon mode. That's killing my health bar. Oh, I can still do that move without being in demon mode. Okay, cool. Let's go, dual swords. Yeah, no, that was definitely rad, though. Kind of want to make a status dual blade set in G and absolutely run house with it. Yeah, they, they could have just not done that. Let me try to send a link in meme. Go for it, go for it. Alright, so it looks like the last hit has to connect in order to do the the falling slashes. Yeah. Sent. Alright, I'll check it out here in a minute, man. Oh, that's great, though. 10 out of 10 quote. Oh, you're not escaping me. We fast as fuck here. Who in the Funimation studio said it was a good idea to make that translation? I know, right? That's what I'm saying. Uh oh, he bit me. Imagine how many people that had to pass through before it got the green light. Wish you luck for not for Super Saiyan for SSG Goku. Go for it. You mentioning status dual blades? Uh makes you want to make a vamp set and absolutely dual blades it yeah that's what i'm thinking like i've been told that vampirism is like one of the more mandatory skills in g rank and i've been thinking like if i can get a hold of that that'll make the ability to stay in the super demon mode like a lot more viable
No, you don't. You didn't get him? Oh, I'm sorry, Nosh. Oh, there he goes. There goes the boy. Abnormality is needed for status as well, since it's rise status trigger, but all the time. What do you mean by rise status trigger? Hello, Naj. Welcome. Welcome to the chat again. <laughs> I don't I don't remember what status trigger does, honestly. Oh, you could transition. I'm 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 in I'm liking I'm liking extreme dual swords. It's very very nice. Stash trigger increases status ailment chance to procs after doing a perfect dodge. That sounds familiar. You might not be wrong. That that sounds very familiar. Oh, I see, I see. So, status trigger is the balanced version of that. No, 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 no. Normally, status has a 1 in 3 chance to apply on hit, and status trigger and abnormality both make it 100%, but status trigger has a dodge prerequisite. It also gives status attack up, status pursuit, and drug knowledge. Ooh. Oh, no, no, it gives that instead. Okay. I see, I see. I mean, it happens. It happens. Not too much to worry about. Uh, upgrade. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Do I? Oh, I can go ahead and do it to the arms. I need more Gendrum scales. You haven't looked into it before, you're just running off of what your goldfish brain can remember? Same. Then what skill were you thinking of? I have no idea. I have no idea, but I gotta re-equip my decos. I think I had one hearing deco. Two survivabilities. Uh, I think I had status resist in. Question of today by your host, Naj. What's your favorite Dragon Ball character and why? Uh, I'll be totally honest, dog. I don't really think I have a favorite Dragon Ball character. Hmm. Thinking on it, I should be able to make the... Poison dual swords, the Iodrome ones. Three. 
You might find this surprising, but mine isn't Raditz. <laughs> uh, no, I, I don't have a favorite because I think I think they're all really cool. Most of them, at least. It'd be easier to name the ones I don't like. Uh... Wait, hold up. I'm looking at... No, that's Go Weapons. Oops, I want to look at G rank. I was so confused. What about long swords? Can I get spider wards? Flower fields or endpoints? Swax. Hard pick, honestly. Most of them are good. But Pecan. Rats has just been my username on Discord for so long, it's pretty much infected everything. Gohan's your favorite because he's hacks. Aren't they trying to, um... Ooh. Ooh. What the fuck? Why does this have so much more attack power? Because that one's not a G rank weapon. I see, I see. What about Tonfas? Raviente materials. This one looks like it'd be the earliest one to make. Favorite form in the Dragon Ball series? I mean, I don't really have a favorite form in Dragon Ball. You like UI? It's unique. Ultra Instinct is... How, I don't, it's not really that unique. It's basically another power-up. It's basically Dragon Ball's answer to Bankai. I feel like. SSJ Rose, Subarashi. I haven't made a sword and shield yet, I don't think. Yeah, some of these are gonna require some more adventuring and I need to get myself settled on an armor first. I mean, it... I'm be real, they use those terms very loosely because they seem kind of the same to me. It's like Kaioken in that sense. I mean, yeah, I guess. I don't know. A lot of the... Super... Uh, Super's not my favorite out of the whole Dragon Ball series, I'm gonna be totally honest. It, it just does a lot of stuff that it doesn't really need to. What do I have my... It's at plus one. Fencing decos give three points. I have two slots left. That's not going to work out. What's gallery attack? Attack expert and adrenaline. I guess I'll do this, question mark. There's another form called it, uh, called True Ultra Instinct. Hey, Dead Sonic, what's up? How are you doing? I did make it to G rank. I got here yesterday. Yeah. Yeah, I'm working on the armor right now.
Super Saiyan 3 and Super Saiyan Rose are your favorites. Out of the two, Super Saiyan Rose is cooler because Scythe. Ultra Instinct is just a different feel from all the others. I guess. Like, I know a little bit about Super. I've seen some episodes, but, like, I, I have a hard time enjoying it. It doesn't feel like Dragon Ball anymore. It feels like generic battle, sh d generic shonen battle anime. Ultra Instinct is unique, and you had to agree. I mean, if you feel that way, that's fine. Like, my, my knowledge on Dragon Ball, beyond Dragon Ball Z and the uh, movies, is very limited. Don't get me wrong. I'll still probably watch all the Dragon Ball movies whenever they as they come out. Uh, just so I can have a vague upkeep on the series. But, like, I, I've not really got any interest in watching Super. In all honesty, Super's kind of lame. And there's Chad Han who unlocks a new form in superhero movie Beast. I haven't watched Superhero yet. I will say that. Gohan Blanco reincarnated. Gohan White reincarnated. <laughs> what was that? I thought he got hit. Homie did a backflip. The story is super generic. And like... I call it Milktoast Shonen with the understanding that it is Dragon Ball. But, like, Dragon Ball used to be one of the defining shonen genre series. And to watch them devolve into the into becoming the epitome of, uh, of shonen archetypes is a little saddening. Because they used to be really innovative. You hope when Super comes back, they stick to the manga because the anime was pretty much ahead of the manga all of Super. Oh, was it? I didn't know that. In the beginning, there's no such thing as super manga. Super is an anime original. I mean, yeah, but like, it could have been better. Oh, so even though I'm immune to the status, it still takes away my red health. Last time the anime had no guidance, we got GT. I mean, I've said it in a hot take before. I didn't think GT was all that bad. Super manga changed things up a bit so st story-wise. No, no, no. I think Naj was saying that it used to be ahead of the manga. Let's transition into regular demon mode. Super has a manga, but it was after the anime aired a couple of arcs already. Oh no, the ads. Yeah, they, they showed up. They came to say hi.
Oops, ads. Hello, well. I'll see you guys when the ads are over. Oh, you're back already, Nosh? Welcome back, homie. Take my one free cent. <laughs> it's not even yours. <laughs> uh. I'm really liking dual swords. There are a couple of like moves that don't transition well to each other, I don't think. Just from the way it feels. Give him a hundred dollars at least and split it with me. I don't know about that one, Chief. But no, um Yeah, no. I I really like the feel of dual swords so far. It's just that they there's something about them. There there are some moves that don't feel like they transition very well to each other. But overall, overall, I'm, I'm really liking Extreme Dual Swords. Welcome back, Raditz. Uh, item patches full? Oh, right, the healing items and stuff that I take and then immediately use my own gear. Gendrum scale? As in low rank Gendrum scales? Didn't know I could get low rank mats in G rank. Interesting. take a look at that meme real quick oh it's a video I can't uh, I can't play it not on stream I'll have to look at it afterwards I'm sorry <laughs> could be like, I heard your pee addiction is strong, let me f- Nosh. <laughs> Are you good, my guy? Poor Nosh. One to six. Man, that's a bit of an L streak you got going on there. So one, what would even increase you winning? Uh, resisting the urge to say things that are intrusive. That would help. Nah, I don't know. I'm cool with it as long as you don't go overboard, man. Refined G armor. Oh no, I don't want to do that. I need GR1 gems. I still gotta do this one. This is a one sided battle. I mean, that's relative, I think. I heard your Monster Hunter addiction is strong. Let me fight it one ass beating later. It's too powerful! <laughs> that's. <laughs> That is Frontier right there. I think I need to do this one again. Uh, the Navi does give you materials outright, but... Um, does it? 
I think it gives... I think it gives, uh, items to you that you can use to, uh... To get to the first, uh, evolution of them. But then you have to, uh... If you want to fully do it, you still have to grind them out. I think is how it is. I'll, I'll check again whenever I get back in there. Oh, it caused stamina to do the jump attack, because I it wasn't letting me. Yeah, it does. What's up, Bonk? It's going all right. Usually, G rank Navi is just killing new G rank monsters and it gives you uh, materials for better armor. Does it? Yeah, I'm in the Entora line. I might not need to be in the Entora line. I do know that evolving the armor is giving me extra deco slots, so I'm trying to get those settled. Uh, fantastic question. I got a little bit lost because I was working on it last night and then got tired and went to bed. But I'm swapping between the GF and Z GX. I think I've still... Uh, the waste piece is still in the GF form, I believe. I need decos to make this build decent, you'd need to hit the road. I mean, I'm going for whatever. I'm just trying to get a couple of armor sets going so that way I can start making a variety of weapons and get comfortable with those. That's my current game plan. Not just like a couple of the same type either. Floor 10 unlocks G decos. I see, I see. And G decos are better than the um, the other deco Gs, the ones I've been using, right? I think he's talking about G rank decos. I can be absolutely curb stomped. Let me get my health back. More G decos. Is it called touching grass? I don't know, Naj. Can you say the same? There were acquisition quests for those, supposedly, or at least a lot of them. Those were for G decos you could get before G rank. I mean, I live in a tropical monsoon area, there's plenty of grass. You're heading out, Raditz. Go ahead, man. Take it easy. Thanks for stopping by. There are also gear acquisition quests for G-Rank Decos.
there is, but Road's the best place to get them since you can just buy them outright once you hit floor 10. Yeah, but I, I'm currently very much so lacking on endpoints and GCP at the moment. Unless the rollover finally happened and I can collect on the net points. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. My sharpness is super low. You can buy them with road points. Oh, right. Road points are a currency. Yeah, yeah. I didn't even need to use those. Oh, well. Yeah, no, I'm starting to really like dual swords. <clears throat> With the Antora set, I might be able to get to floor 10. If I want some help getting to floor 10, you can help out with that. Welcome to the dual swords bandwagon. I mean, I like all weapons, honestly. It's, it's going to take me some time getting used to... Um, getting used to Hunting Horn in Frontier, though. I haven't messed with that at all. Like, I messed with it a little bit, but not very much. Let's not drop the water into the floor before the lid's on it. That would be bad. No, I want to I wanna get used to all the weapons. I want to try out all the weapons, but I do need to get myself settled. Um, let's see where we're at with armor after this. Your outfit is matching the Father Kurai vibes. <laughs> uh, you can go for the Furogata set before hitting the road. Which one's Furogata? Is that a monster I haven't fought yet? It's the second set I'm going to make? Okay. Alright. Upgrade you. All right, and that brings both of them to blue. We gotta set my decos back in. It's the only thing I'm not liking is that it removes decos. Uh. Let's do a fencing there. Let's see. I want to keep that hearing deco. Remove those two. And set two more fencing. And I think... Or am I short? I'm short one point. Uh, status fencing is necessary. We'll drop the hearing deco. I don't need it. I'd rather have the fencing deco. Uh, let me get back to this. Second set I'm going to make. Naj. <laughs> you can make it right now. You just have to do the upgraded uh, for Ogata G quest five times. Since the Navi quest only unlocks when you hit GR2 tab in the Navi. 
One through seven. And the Navi task for making the Furogata set gives the mats for the other four pieces without needing to do the quest four times. Okay. Okay, so as far as the Navi goes... This is where I'm at right now. Now that I'm rocking the priest outfit, are you Pope Kurai technically? No, I don't have a Pope hat. I would be if I if it gave me a Pope hat, but I don't have a Pope hat. Yeah, like this is this is where I'm at on this. It wants me to be at level seven with each piece. Oh, this one's still at level four. Let me let me see what I need to do to fix that. I need GR1 gems. Pokeradon or Yankaku. But I'm also supposed to be getting those gems from the Gaia Prey, right? Or not the Gaia Prey, the Gendrome. I'm getting the names mixed up. You hope new Monster Hunter 6 will bring a new weapon? I hope Monster Hunter 6 brings back a lot of the ignored stuffs. Don't upgrade One Piece to level 7. Why is that? Make sure to upgrade all to GX1 before upgrading them more. Oh, are some of them going to use similar materials? And it'll mess up the sequence if I do that? Because I think that's what I ended up doing. The GX upgrade path requires conque conquest proofs. Uh-huh. You need a conquest proof to get the armor to GX. And you only get proofs from doing conquests. What are conquests exactly? Stuff like Shantian. Oh, I see, I see. Conquest is a mode in Battlefield. Thanks, Naj. Very insightful. 10 out of 10. Thing is, the proofs are 1% drops from level 1 conquests. I see. So, yeah, yeah, I see, I see, because it's only going to give me five conquests, yeah, I see. Cat, will you please stop scratching on the chair? You have a box over in the corner. Since the upgrade... Since the upgrade your pieces to GX task will give you more proofs to upgrade them further. Yeah, and it wants you to do all five pieces, right? I see, I see. I getcha. Uh, that's what we're gonna work towards then, I guess. Because a lot of the recommendations I keep seeing towards new hunters seem to be follow the hunter navi. 
since it'll help you figure things out. Yeah, yeah. No, I appreciate it. I really do. I probably would have done exactly that if you didn't give the advice. You already saw a guy fuck up his progression by upgrading his Entora head to GX7 before getting the other pieces to GX1. Yikes. Was this another streamer or was this just another guy playing the game? Sheath. Potion. Another guy in Burr. I see, I see. Yeah, I don't want to mess that up. In Burr's chat. Oh, okay. No, I, I, I understand fat, fat fingering the enter button. There we go. Very good, very good. I think this is the last Gendrome I have to do. I think. The quest for killing Guan is locked behind GR5 permits. So I have to do GR 1 through 4. I mean, I was just going to take the G rank quests in order anyway. I, I had planned on making uh, as many of the armors and weapons that I could. I'll be totally honest. Just so I have a nice variety to pick from. GR 2 gems. I think I need GR1 gems. The last quest in each G tab ha gives the permits for the next rank. G weapons upgrade differently than normal weapons. Yeah, I noticed that. You, you go to improve them instead of upgrading them. Like, I, I experimented with it a little bit last night. And I figured out that Level 1 to 100. I see, I see. Uh, can I claim endpoints yet? Nope. I need a G50 weapon to be able to do the hardest conquests. Ugh. Hmm. Let's see. In either case, I've got to level them up much differently than in other Monster Hunters. Uh, armors, upgrade... Yeah, I spent my GR1 gems on, uh... I may or may not have spent my GR1 gems on, uh... Another weapon. I just get one with GCP. And that fixes that. R2 and R1. There we go. So that gives me the conquest proofs. Eh, it's fine. 
I didn't mind using my GCP on it. I didn't have a whole lot anyway. I'll just grind it back up. Yeah. I, I, I just didn't want to repeat another raptor hunting quest. <laughs> Uh. Alright, so I'm going to upgrade my armor again, and it's going to kick all of my decos out again. Yep. Yeah, so what the other guy did was he actually used his Ultima proofs on these, right? He, he did it all on one piece. And that's exactly what I don't want to do. Uh, need to shove my decos back into the armor. Fencing. Status fencing. Uh, throw those in. Throw those in. I guess throw this in. And we'll just do a status resist for good measure. Uh, short sprinter. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't like that. What's giving me that? It's on the head and the chest. Is it a decoration doing it? It is a decoration doing it. It's the fencing decos. Yeah, I, I had forgotten. I'll just deal with it. Why not? Uh, so the next thing... See, it can, re it can be refined as a decoration after being upgraded to level 7. This task gets completed if you read it. Okay. If I get eating two G decos, I can counter it and have speed eating at the same time. That sounds really nice, actually. I like speed eating. Speed eating is very handy. I used to not really care about it. All right. G rank Garen Zibaru is very difficult since it's a G7 monster, so try changing the difficulty when taking the quest. Also reduce the damage received using a Halk Pot, and use the power of a legendary Rasta with a legendary Rasta ticket that can be obtained in the previous task. You'll be rewarded with the materials for the Garen G armor. I see. Hunter Navi is such a baby. <laughs> uh Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna test it out. I'm gonna poke at it. Alright, so it's a G seven. I don't have G5 permits. Oh, Gren's now in G5. Okay. But 
but I'm not going to have G5 permits. So I'll actually be incentivized to go through G1 through G4 before I can do Garen Zubaru. Because the Navi skips it. Yeah, okay, I see, I see. That's not too bad. I'm okay with that. In all honesty, I'm okay with that. Alright, that's Pokedron. I don't think I've fought one before. If I have, I don't remember it. Um, you said I should be good for road, right? So, we're gonna go give that a try. What'd you suggest for Burr? Before the urgent for the permits. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna poke it road real quick. I wanna see No items allowed on road? Does it give you items? Okay, so it says no items are allowed. So let me stuff everything away. Oh, I have to buy my own items for road. Oh, is it is it like when uh is it like the item shop uh, NPC that shows up whenever you're doing uh what's it called? Make sure you set road skills. What are road skills? Are those back at the lady? Road skill points earned by increasing your road rank to unlock useful road skills to help you in many ways. Do the top road quest. Check your status, road status. Okay. Oh. I see, I see. I don't need to unlock them. They're all unlocked right now. I just have to equip them. Let's equip this one. Oh, so the higher level ones, you do need to... No, okay. I see my cost do attack power I don't know what's coming up on the road so I'm not going to worry about elemental defenses for guardians only uh, we'll do this too expensive do that version Yeah, each of them have an equip cost. I don't need to worry about elemental resistance since I, until I get to zeniths. Yeah, because zeniths are the ones that have the extreme blights and stuff like that. Alright, inventory is dumped. I'm going to run dual swords on road for a little bit. So, do the very top one. The endless road. Ugh, I gotta I've gotta go grind out some uh Warning Rosses cannot join, Partnyas cannot join, Halk cannot join, Soul Revival effects will be disabled, Halk Pots will be disabled. That is fine. I'm still figuring out road anyway. 
Alright, so how exactly does road work? Buy items. I see, I see. Let's buy a stack of these. Stack of these. Uh, let's do two, three well done stakes. Bleed cure. I'm going to need whetstones. Okay. Okay. Uh, I guess I talked to the road. Oh, I see, I see. Uh, hmm. Let's do this. I'm assuming they're the G-rank versions of the monsters, too. Each player has their own carts. Okay. How do I... Oh, there we go. The reward cost usually dictates how easy the monster will be. Well, I've also not been able to defeat a hardcore Rajang. And I have made an attempt. And I would just rather not. Oof. Like I'm I'm not fun I'm not fond of fighting Shogun Sienatar and Hardcore Rajang is just pain for me. Go lurk for a little while. All right, go ahead, Naj. Oh, he caught up to me. Also, every 10 floors you fight white fatalis. Yeah, I knew I know about that. Dodge that shit. I knew about the White Fatalis. That's one of the reasons why I was excited for Road. Because I want to fight the Super White Fatalis at some point and beat it. I don't like your poison breath very much. Ouch. Doing road with would be best with vampirism because healing's not too much of a luxury. Oof. That is a good point. Road 100% needs vampirism. Sounds like it. Yeah, that move, that's that's the big reason why I don't really like Sienitar as far as fights go. I like the monster as a concept, but that move itself is just annoying. Hello. The G get the G decos that give vampirism are locked behind road, so yeah, I see how do it how getting those would be impossible. Starting out. Yep. 
Yeah, I'm gonna triple cart, more than likely. And the GX decos that give vamp are further in the G line. Maybe dual swords aren't the best mods, uh, weapons to start road off with either. Probably would have been better to go with sword and shield for the more evasive fighting I can use. Oh, come on. Oh, you cheated my weapon. There's some low tier monsters that give amp decos. You know how to do Veka Deco's give vamp. Lance is also a really good uh, a really good matchup against Ruko. Might have signed you up to die by telling you to do road with an Entora set, maybe. Not gonna lie, I thought you were trolling at first. I, I, I don't mind taking an L if it makes it funny. I'll be totally honest with you. It's part of the reason why I agreed to do it. <laughs> but no, I'm gonna triple cart. You were doing a bit of trolling. I figured. Blue cut kudekos literally give vampirism. Yeah, because this move just combos you, and if he spams it like he is now, it's just death. That tremor reaches really far. Yep, here we go on the pain train again. Oh, nope, he messed up the angle. Oh, there I go. I'm done. Yep. I thought I could probably turn it around once I... Oh, I already have the lid off. Well, I'm assuming you don't keep road bot items. So what, monsters have their own decos now? Let's take let's take a gander at what's available. Okay, so monsters have their own dedicated decos. That's interesting. So like if I go over to the Smithy And look at the G rank decos. It's gonna show like Gendrome, Velocidrome, Iodrome. G rank weapons. No, I need decorations. So G grade or GX? 
Or is it in the G Deco tab? It's GX. Monsters. Ah, I see. First hack up. Excuse me. It's GX decos, refined GX decos. You can either make an armor piece and refine it into. Or just make the deco outright with the monster's rare drops. I see. So that's what grinding out the armor is supposed to do. I'm assuming everyone just, just makes the uh, deco itself instead of grinding out the armor. It's a waste of time to grind the armor. It either takes one G rare drop plus a hardcore drop or one G rank 1% drop. Yeah, just, just based off that, it sounds way better. Okay. All right, I'll take a look at those later. What, what are some other ones? Monster Festival? Content. Events. Other. <sighs> okay. Uh, I think for now it would be better just to go check out the monster list. Pick something and go after it. I feel like that would be the best course of action. Get my bearings a little bit better, and then figure out a plan based off of that. Uh, I'm gonna go after Pokedron. Let's see. Box. You know what, I didn't... Polar C. Gonna need hot drinks. The G2 permit giver instantly? What? He's not a hard monster? I don't think I've fought him before is the thing. He's just a goofy goober. Oh wait, this is the this is the walrus, isn't it? I wanted to come here because there was also something else I was supposed to get from the Polar Sea. I don't remember what it was, but I remember seeing the item. Is this just gonna give me worms and stuff? Yeah, it's just gonna be worms. Some people hate him. It's back to basics, I think. Polar Sea theme is also a banger. Oh, I didn't even think about the permits, I'll be totally honest. Yeah, no, I I I just I haven't fought it before, so I figured why not? Oh, they have two carbs each. I see, I see. That's just how progression works. Okay. All 
All right, so G rank is just a whole other ball game compared to everything else, just from the looks of it. Now, how is this growing in a floating block of ice? That's what I want to know. Pouch is full. Why is your bag full of stuff? Um, shut the worms. I don't need worms. There was something I was supposed to be able to mine. There's the Pokedron, I'm assuming. What the fuck? Huh? Did he, like, follow me over? Alright, look, man. I didn't want to fight. I want to mine first. Where? I don't see any mining nodes in here. Oh, no, nope, there's one. Let's go get from here. Ice stone. Mm. Shop the blue mushrooms. Everlasting ice cubes. Drop the herbs. No more mining from that. Ooh. Ooh, I like the looks of this cave. Very nice, very nice. Can do fishing, there are bugs. Gotcha, gotcha. Looks like a plant. I don't want to gather a plant. I don't see any more mining nodes in here. There's another plant gathering spot. A little hard to see things in those areas. Carbolite. Lazarite. Alright, I guess we're fighting him now. Hey, Calamite. Hippity hoppity, this ice cap is now your property. <laughs> How are you doing, Calamite? You doing good? Oh, that's good. I'm glad. Got to G rank yesterday. Hot drink effect expired. Oh. That's a pitfall. Uh, I think he just ice blighted me. I ran right into it. Let's 
get out of the way of whatever that is. Just gonna leave a few pitfalls. Went and beat for Answer and Kojima Cannon's fun weapons. Are you talking about, uh, Armored Core? Took me a second to remember what the series was called. Oops. Are they, like, actual cannon cannons where they're, like, single shot, or are they just high-caliber machine guns, or what? How are they working? Okay, Poke Drone. Well, at least you put my weapons away for me. Single charge shot takes a while and lowers your PA, but does some devastating damage. Ooh, that's spicy. That's really spicy. You got a clip of it? If you've got a clip of it, drop it in Discord. I want to watch it. I want to look at it later. You can do that quickly. All right, cool, cool. That has a really wide hitbox. I thought we were done with the obscenely huge hitboxes. I thought we had knocked him down. He left. The final mission where you had to fight four armored cores, you halved their focus before they could land in the battlefield. Is it making it easier on you, or, or what's going on with that? Straight one-shots them? Oh, jeez. Talk about cutting down the competition. Last two died as well. Same attack. That has a really big shockwave. But I think I see what's hitting me on it. Rip Voldo.
fully charged Kojima cannon. Same. Yep. How long does it take to charge up? For, like, comparison sakes. Because you're still talking about Last Raven, right? Like, specifically Last Raven? No, for answers, the last 4th gen game. Okay, okay, okay. Missed that part. I missed that part. Maybe I should switch off of dual swords for a little while and get used to G rank. Cause like, especially with the way dual swords plays with extreme style, the way it seems to want to play at least, I feel like I'm going to need vampirism to make it work better. I dove way too early. Back off to heal. It's so weird not getting near one shot anymore. I feel like I'm back within my expected power level. It's very strange to me. Max out my sharpness. There's a poogie item. Go grab that. It's another mega. Let's drink another energy drink. Yeah, I wasn't expecting him to... It was. They said he was easy. I'm sure he is. I'm just being way too aggressive. I still haven't quite, quite fully gotten the hang of dual swords. I'm playing way too aggressively.
Okay, so it still kicks me out of that demon mode whenever I take proper knockback. Okay. And I longer, no longer have my transcendence either. Ah, uh, no. That had a hitbox on it? Okay. Boldo hasn't been using very many... That's my hit us. Nope. Not even close. Waldo hasn't been using any life powders, though. It's kind of weird. Oh, dodged way too early. from me. Oh, I didn't think he was doing that. Did I bounce off of the wall? You've got a clip of a non-fully charged shot? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead and drop it in Discord and I'll take a look at it as soon as I, as soon as I get out of this quest. Hard oof. Wonder if base camp box has a uh, has a resupply on items. A little embarrassing to have already run through twenty mega potions. There we go. Uh, rest in bed. Is that a little pet seal? Or did it just decide to come vibe with us? That thing's cute. Okay. Can I, like, pet it? No? No. It wants me to rest in the bed if I do that. Okay. Well, whatever. sharpen real quick they're just really small friendly monsters I see kind of like the little yellow guys over at the flower fields oh the younger versions of the aggro ones I see I see
birthday babies. They're cute, that's for sure. And then they go, they grow up to become a Pokedron, right? Kind of like Ludroth to Royal Ludroth. Yeah. I keep forgetting about the tail swipe there. Yeah, for grinding, I might have to stick with Sword and Shield. You're currently converting the, uh, the video to Discord-friendly format. Oof. I'm in a hole. Yep. That sounds about right. I wonder how close I am to taking him out. Because I don't feel like I've done any damage to him at all. Go ahead and transcend. and use Hexaflash. No, I'm max power real quick. Oh, does he just spam that whenever he's blind? Alright, he's leaving. He left, he left. Nice. I was trying to dodge away. Oh, his tail comes off? I didn't know his tail comes off. It is in the ice. Can I 
not get to it. I, I need this to break, please. Please. I, I, I want the tail. Alright, whatever. Come on, Voldo. It's not worth it. Not only did I discover that the tail can be severed, but I can't even get to it to carve it. 10 out of 10. Love this game. Oh, I have been doing damage. Uh, guess he's not gonna roar. Right, frontier monsters don't always roar. doing damage Spat, despite doing very badly as far as the playing goes. Need to sheathe. still hit. Come on, Pokedron. There we go. Shame I can't get the tail. Subquest A is clear. I don't know what subquest A was, but dope. <clears throat> Pokedron was interesting. I need to switch away from dual swords. I'm, my brain wants to get overly aggressive using them. For us. Do I not have you open anymore? No, here you are. Oh, excuse me. Okay. Controller, come back. Gatron bones, claws, GR2 permits. Oh, wow. It just gives you a ton. Okay. I like Pokedron. Pokedron's cool.
Uh, let's... I'm gonna make a sword and shield. Make a G-rank weapon. So, weapons, G-rank, sword and shield. What are you? Any dark orbs and GR1 gems. We will work on getting this one. I like the look of it. It looks really dope. Alright, I know I can get black orbs from... Uh, the anti camellios quest. For the gear acquisition. Uh, part in your bag. Store all this stuff, please. Thank you. Nothing in the extra box. Cool. Alright. Off to slay Daimyo Hermitar. I'm gonna get that, uh, Dark Sword and Shield. And I'll run that for a little bit. Use that to make other gear. Excuse me. Hmm. Alright, I think he starts on the island. This is a fantastic question. He is not on the island. Well. Oh, that's because he moved along over to here already. You got a clip of a heavyweight next, just living on a thread of AP from a fully charged blast. Bro, make that AP count. Sounds like you're gonna need it. Over 40k down to 1931 AP. Oof. That is a lot. How much does the cannon use? Or are you using something else that's firing rapidly? Where did my health go? <laughs> oh, wow. Have ARs clean up and keep pressure depending on the case. Oh, that's where all the ammo's going? Yeah, that'll do it. Kojima cannons only have single digits in the ammo, six on the ones I use. You're talking about in their magazines? Before you have to reload, right?
Oh, total? Okay, okay. Sorry I'm being so quiet, I just, I'm a little bit mesmerized by my moveset. It's a little on the crazy side. Say that since they just wiped the primal armor off, uh, ne uh, next year ARs do even more damage, making cleanup all the more easy. Yeah, that's fair enough. That sounds really nice. I gotta play. I gotta play Armored Core at some point. A six is gonna be out like towards the end of this year, right? Sometime in August, I think you said, or was it September? September to October is the range. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm definitely going to pick it up whenever it comes out. Right, I'm going to heal and sharpen. He left the area. Now, like, I think the crazy thing is, is I've seen more Armored Core news lately than I had ever seen for Armored Core. And I feel like people are just now realizing that FromSoft are the people behind the series. I definitely don't want to be hit right now. Oh, this is gonna suck. Nope, it's not doing the backwards attack. Okay, I'll take it. Ouch. 
Another para. Very good. Still in, yeah, I am. <clears throat> I need to. I didn't break the other claw, I just realized. It seems like healing items don't work on me whenever I'm in this state. Which explains why Voldo hadn't been using them on me very much before. He left again. Let's see, it's this way. Do a sharpen real quick. Get that purple sharpness back. Uh, let's grab this. Large diluted pearl. Not too bad, not too bad. Hermitar scissors. It's a little over 10 minutes. Way better than the 30, mi 30 minutes that the Pokedron took. Hermitar scissor. Alright. Uh, I should probably go do some mining. Get access to those G rank materials. up to five. Nope. Not enough time to make it to a mining node. Should have went a different direction. Oh well. Two more black orbs. No G stones. How many more do I need? That's what I want to know. Oh, excuse me. Uh, nope, I backed too far out. Uh, I'm talking to the wrong NPC. Come on, stop it. Stop it. Load up, please. Thank you. Weapons. G rank. Sword and shield. I need four more black orbs, two more GR gems. Which I can get for Pokedron or Yonkaku. Yonkaku might be easier. 
Uh, I don't want to talk to the cat, please. Stop it. What about partner here? What can we do for G rank armor? Not a whole lot. All right, I'm gonna take a small break to uh, to to go use the restroom, and to go ahead and run another ad to get rid of it f to get rid of pre rolls. So I will be back in a minute. Uh, BRB. All right, I'm back. 
Let's see. There we go. Uh, let's do that Hermitor again. Actually, let's take a look to see what the Hermitor armor needs. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a gander at that. Because I'd been hunting it, I didn't think to actually look to see what it would need to be built. Herbivore Bright Shells. Europe and Antecas. And it needs GR gems. Okay. So that's fine. I'll uh, I'll worry about the um, those black pearls first. Uh, do I want to run it with dual swords or do I want to run it with that great sword? I'll run it with the dual swords. I don't know how I interacted with that box, but okay. Starting in nine. Go ahead and energy drink, armor skin. I'm not going to bother trying to go to 10. He's probably just going to travel over to 3 by the time I'm over there. That's not a big deal. That's not that big of a deal. I can't speak today. Alright. There you are. Fills up my gauge pretty well, honestly. Nice knockdown. Good para, good para. All right, let's get out of there. Get healed up. Staying on the good hit zones is really, really helping with all the staggers. Elemental seems like it's going to be really nice with dual swords and with extreme style. Hey, Naj, welcome back. How are you doing? Still hit me. Nope, he's going underground. Not much. Still grinding out Dokkan.
No. Not anymore. Playing Roblox? People still play Roblox? Really? You feel like you're seven again? I mean, it's a game made for kids. I w I'm not surprised by you feeling like a kid. I I'm just surprised to hear that people still play it. And like, don't get me wrong, I'm not judging. Don't don't misinterpret that. I just I, I thought I thought Roblox got beat out by like other games. I don't know. I never really kept up with it. So just hearing that it still exists is a bit surprising. There's 30 million active people daily? You're kidding. Really? Bro. I thought it might have a user base of like a thousand or so still. That was still running. 30 million? Yeah, no, it, like the age doesn't really matter if they're, as long as they're playing it. Like, Wow. Oh, I'm down to green. You'll look the most game with a lot of players in Roblox real quick. Yeah, because Roblox was all about, like, user-made minigames, wasn't it? Something like that? Uh-oh. I wasn't tabbed into the game. I need to stop doing that. Alright. Uh, craft. Brookhaven RP has 762,000 players online. What is Brookhaven RP? Is it a role play? Is that what that is? Yeah, okay. What the fuck? Oh, Bullfango. A trashy role playing game? Define trashy like. Like, trashy anime trashy, or just, like, actually bad, or what? That's Roblox in general. I mean, I did define it a little bit. Gmod Dark RP? Oh, okay, okay, I see. I understand. I wish I didn't understand, but I understand. Yeah, so it looks like whenever I'm in this demon mode state, his healing items don't actually work on me.
Which is an interesting way to keep that ability... Fr to keep that demon mode under check. Because you do have to leave it in order to recover your health. Yeah, no, I wonder if people realize they can go to much better places for their trashy role plays. I'll be totally honest. If you're just gonna stand still, I mean, I'll take it. Rip Shogun. Not Shogun. Daimyo. Tsunami Sack. Nice. Nice. Let's go back up. I wonder. Okay. I mean, it's a way to have the weapons drawn on your way down, I guess, but it didn't do what I thought it was going to do. Wait, this is a mining node. I forgot that this was a mining node. <clears throat> and I got an iron ore. Sounds about right. Alright, got two more black orbs. Got a GR1 gem. Nice. Roblox Frontline, aka Roblox Call of Duty. I mean, I heard some of the Roblox games back in the day were actually on par with uh, good developers, or good develop, yeah, good developers, um, and they were like on par with some AAA titles and stuff like that. It's full of hackers, sadly. Oh, yeah, that is unfortunate. Security is hot, Garbo. That's rough. Very rough. Oh, excuse me. Poor person, Bento. For a kid's game, you'd expect the security to be high. No, not at all. Making kids games are probably some of the easiest ways to make money, honestly, in the short term. Slap some kid-friendly logos on it, make it easy to play. Boom. You just made a ton of money off of parents who don't inspect games very well. But, like, why would they? Not a whole lot of parents play video games. Or at least it's how it used to be. Hello, Hermitar. I saw you teleport around. Don't pretend like you didn't. Okay. The moderation can be described as scarily la lacking. Yikes.
Scarily lacking is the worst kind of moderation, in my opinion. If I had a kid one day and they used my credit card without your knowledge, I'd be hitting them with Demon Flurry Dance combo. <laughs> Shouldn't be hitting children, Naj. It's not okay. Anyone, really. Now, instead of hitting your children, you need to football punt them across the soccer field. So they'll understand one day. I, I think there's better ways to go about it, is the thing. Slam dunk them into a trash can? Yes, exactly what Calamite said. You know, I figured he would just attack me instead of doing the same spot. But, uh, we take those. What hit me? Is what I want to know. Put them back inside your wife. Don't punish your wife like that, man. <laughs> Where it belongs. Naj, that's a... Uh, that's a part of the internet that I never thought would enter my stream, and I'd rather it not. Let's let's not. I, I don't subscribe to those kinds of fantasies. Thank you very much. Come on, Hermitar. Alright, I'm gonna have to heal up a little bit. The easiest game simulator, surprisingly, Xbox 360, PS3 games, because then you have requires basically no setup. Just drag and drop and it's good to go. Yep. They are really nice to emulate. I need to, uh... What I really need to do is I need to get into, uh, Fantasy Star Universe again. I loved that game. One of my favorite Xbox 360 games, not gonna lie. And it's honestly the franchise that uh, got me into science fantasy. Alright, I gotta back off. I did start playing, like, Fantasy Star Online. I did the very first tutorial mission and then forgot to continue playing it. I'll be totally honest. Like, where I'm at in Frontier is probably the longest I've spent playing an MMO. Not gonna lie. I 
I, I don't, I don't, I have a bad habit of just not sticking with MMOs. I played Final Fantasy XIV up until like level 7, I think. And stopped playing it after that. PPSSPP is another good one for very little setup. Yeah, that's actually what I played. Um, that emulator is what I played uh, Freedom Unite and Portable Third on relatively recently. I say relatively. It was like last year at some point. Although I played more of uh, Portable Third than I did uh, Freedom Unite. One more. No? He's just gonna keep going. There he is. Is he leaving? No. Hello. Thank you, Voldo. Yeah, I'm, I'm really fond of some emulators. I do Visual Boy Advance for Game Boy. Although, if there are better emulators, I'd like to know about them. Easy Barrel Bomb L. So I'm, I'm sure there are better Game Boy Advance emulators. Now, I've not found a good DS emulator outside of Citra, but I don't know if Citra can go to regular DS games or if it's 3DS only. I didn't mean to do that. I missed him. Oh well. Oh, that had a hitbox on it? Okay, Bulfango. Okay, there we go. That was much better time. Bye, Bulfango. Valor already has that move. Ooh, you had glossy skin. Are you also going to have glossy skin? Interesting. I like how Voldo is just standing there and not doing anything about the Bulfango. Beast blood. Oof. Okay. Quest clear. Ooh, another GR gem. Alright, that's all the black orbs. Ooh, that should be all the GR gems. And we got another one in that rewards pile. 
Okay, so we're, we're swimming in items. So we're gonna go make the sword and shield first, and I'm gonna start poking at uh, the armors that need GR gems. What channel do I put the Kojima cannon clip in? Uh, there should be a clips channel. I think the intent behind that clips channel is it's for Twitch streams, but like, eh. If it's just cool clips, funny clips, whatever. I mean, let me see. No, is there not a clips channel? There's not. Uh, drop it in the video edits channel over in art. Doesn't allow videos. Hmm. Video edits should. Terms. General permissions. Allow attached files. Just chatting works. Try dropping, uh... Yeah, that's fine for now. Try dropping it in video edits again real quick, just to see if it works. I changed the permissions around real quick. Uh, if it doesn't work, then it's one of the bots preventing it, and I'm gonna have to go change those settings. It works. Cool, cool. We'll, we'll drop them into that channel from now on, then. Any clips and stuff like that. Alright. So, now we should be able to make that sword and shield. Weapons... G weapon, sword and shield. Ooh, we can make quite a few. I want to make this one, though. Yes, equip now. GR2. Uh, okay, so we'll do that. Great sword, there's Don Jaro. That'll give us a lightning weapon. Can't do anything for long sword. High rank Gogomoa hits really hard. Wait till you hit uh, the Goshu Gogomoa. That's going to be a trip. Especially once you get access to Hardcore. Hardcore is really fun. Alright, so we've got this Sword and Shield. Remove Deco. Uh, Statish. Trackability. Status resist. I can set... No. The weapon doesn't have any slots. Oh, I know. I know. Once you get to HR5 is whenever Goshu starts. That's whenever it's going to crank up on you. Even more. Just just push through it. You'll be fine. I promise. Just take your time like you would any new Monster Hunter. Yeah. Uh, let's upgrade. Can't be upgraded. Right. I have to level it not upgrade it. It can't be leveled? Or is this already capped? Hmm. Okay. Whatever. Uh, look at armors. Uh, we want to look at G rank. Still not a whole lot we can build. Harmatar is missing bright shells. Trying on? No. Oh. Okay. The second one should be in there soonish? Alright, alright. 
Alright, I am set in extreme style, right? Style extreme, affinity plus 20. Alright. Yeah, I'm, I'm really liking the vibes of this sword and shield, though. Uh, let's see what we can do about armor color. No. Nothing. Okay. Well, we take those, I guess. I can't upgrade my armor anymore, right? Right, because I need the conquest proofs. So we've got this. Uh, let's back off of Hermitar for a minute. Go back to the G rank quest, do G1. Uh, let's run through Kaku for a little bit. Alright, I'm interested to see what G rank Kaku looks like here in Frontier. Because Kaku's never been that different between ranks, at least from what I remember. Actually, now that I think about it, I haven't fought a young Kaku in forever. Ooh. It pecks fire. Interesting. I meant to dodge that. Oh, this isn't good. Ha! Huh. Your foot hit me first. Try G Hardcore Kutku. I haven't fought a, a Kutku in forever. I'm not sure how I do against a Hardcore Kutku. Okay, tail. <clears throat> That's a thing you can do. Okay. I'm already sick and tired of Kaku's tail. It's almost as bad as Gypsaros's. Head's broken. KO. There's something satisfying about doing that that slap. I know it's probably not as good as the front flip. But the, the, the mid-air slap with the shield is just really... It feels good. Slap, 
slap, slap, slap, slap, slap. I'll just keep doing this for a hot minute. All right, you know what? I'm not gonna lie. I think Crimson's onto something with this whole Viva SNS thing. Like, I was on board from the beginning just because I like Sword and Shield, but, like, that was kind of swag towards the end, not gonna lie. Like, just casually spinning backwards like a Beyblade, killing the monster. I like the run animation, it's definitely dope. In love with it. And this is just a funny move. You can just spam this pretty easily. Very nice. Alright, so, why did I hunt the Kukku? I genuinely don't remember. I think it was for GR gems. I mean, all I can really do right now is working on grinding out some equipment and decorations. I need to, I need to make my skill set up a little bit more efficient. That's for sure. <laughs> Completed my mission three. What was my mission three? Was it a Kaku? But it was Kaku. Oh, uh, what else we got in GR1? Cephadrome. Gross. Uh. You know, actually, what does. What does the Pokedrome armor give? I want to look at that first, real quick. Let's see. Friendship, welcome, or weapon handling, strong attack, encourage. Wide range, same skills. Same skills. Okay. Okay, I see, I see. Har G hardcore cut coup, it's not what I expect. I feel like you're trolling. Alright, give me a moment and I'll go do it. Kaku armor looks like it's going to be really nice anyway, so. So that's a car from Hermitars or Kusubamis. I mean, I'll, I'll, I'll make the armor. So. We'll go do that. You say it's not what I think, but I, I feel like it's exactly what I think. I feel like it's gonna raffle stomp me. I don't need a map. Why did I grab the map? Is 
Is is is this gonna be like a reskinned cut coup? Is that what this is gonna be? Because like at this point, I'm not really sure what to expect. Fire wave. Oh, has a forward dash. Huh. He's throwing rocks around. That now has a bigger area area of effect. So like he just teleports pretty much. <laughs> Nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition. What's up, Crown? You're a bit late, man. So all the fireball attacks seem to have a shockwave to them. You tried playing Frontier the other day? How did it go, Naj? You don't know how to depart? You go over to the quest gate and you leave through that. Over at Mezaporte. Yeah, you no longer press a button to go. You actually have to go up to a gate and then click go. <laughs> Oof. So you realize you're stupid? How so? How are you stupid? Ooh, little crab. He hid in the sand. He's also got a big chin for non-existent Kanchu. He kinda does. You were mashing start to depart. Yeah, it's not the start button. You just gotta go over to the, to the gate. He might KO me with the rock if I'm not careful. They have that Giga Chin. I mean, I like him. I like him so far. Definitely interesting with the new moveset. Remove start to depart and just depart via quest gate. Yeah. Yeah, using the quest gate is honestly better in my opinion. Oh, he kicked me. Not worth. Extreme SNS looks so cool. It does. It is. It is very nice. All the extreme styles are really nice. I can't wait to play around with uh, extreme heavy bow gun. I'll be totally honest with you. Drill into me, daddy. Naj. Hmm. 
Nosh. I look away for two seconds. My guy. Calm down. Certified Naj Y moment. <laughs> Crown gets it. Crown gets it. Uh, well, I didn't know you were leaving. So far today, four thoughts have won. So the score is what, one to six? You alt tab New Vegas and it won't pull back up. Uh, get wrecked. Old game moment. It's just old Bethesda game moment. Tail whip. You de you de rusted uh, for Skullgirls if you're free tonight. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get Angel to de rust because we're not starting it tonight. <coughs> Excuse me. We're we're not starting fight night tonight. It's gonna be next Saturday night. I gotta start using the dodge. You also in, uh, installed Cursed Halo. How's Cursed Halo going? Your week has been 40% Kurai stream, 50% stream. Uh, eat and sleep and 10% anime. I mean, don't forget about the Dokkan battle. There's a P gun in Cursed Halo now. Why? Nine percent anime and one percent Dokkan. College minus 100%. Seems like it. You need to focus a bit more on that, my guy. Imagine focusing on college. I think you're the one that needs to imagine doing that and actually do it instead of just imagining. My guy. I mean, you're the one paying for it, aren't you? Found out today you're terrible at pastries. Pastries are hard. Making pastries is not the same as making other stuff. Because if you, if you mess up your ingredient count for a pastry, it screws up the whole recipe. Unlike other stuff. With other cooking, you can mess up a little bit and it's not too bad. Donuts or pastry? I know. You effed up real bad today. How so? Ouch.
You followed the ingredients list and it lied. Too much water. Uh, you might have done the wrong measurement for the water. Because if you're following a... They said half a cup and a quarter of a cup. Okay. So you did that? <clears throat> what exactly did the recipe say? You'll pull up the recipe. Not I need to mine over here. Cassiterite? Cassiterite. Pelican ore, haven't seen you in a long time. Four half cups of flour, one tablespoon of yeast, two tablespoons butter, a third cup sugar, one half plus one fourth cups water, two medium eggs. So that'd be three fourths water. I mean, I don't know, man. I'm not sure. And in the video. The water seems to be so little. Oh! No! Okay, hold up. I think what they were saying is you want half of a quarter cup. Which means you need one-eighths a cup of water. I think that's what you... I think that's what it is. I'm not very good at pastries, but I think that's what it was saying. It's using English terminology and English shortcuts in language. <laughs> it's it's use don't don't it's it's not your fault, Naj. It's not your fault. It's it, it's just the way English works. It's just the way English works, my guy. It's confusing sometimes. <laughs> oh no, don't cry, Nosh. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. It's just the language. <laughs> oh, crowd, you're the one being heartless today. Oh man. Bro, that's usually my job. <laughs> All right, where's, where's the Kaku helmet? I need red pearls. Uh, I'll just buy them. I don't feel like hunting regular Hermitor. Okay, crap. <laughs> Gonna make the man cry. How could you do this, crap? Oh, make one of those. <laughs> uh, yeah, you have to upgrade armor in order to get it to high rank. Yeah, I'll hydrate. Crown, why did you do the hi, I'm new? How many points can you waste? I mean... I don't have a whole lot of things active at the moment. I'm kind of reworking all my channel points. I didn't cap the I'm new. Yeah, I should have. Honestly. But at this point, it's funnier not to, not to cap it. <laughs> oh. 
Let's rehydrate him until he combusts from water. <laughs> Guys, chill out. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna drink water every time you do that. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> drink, bro. <laughs> Just drink, bro. <laughs> drink. Alright, let's store that, that, and that. That, 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 and that. And that's what we're gonna go on this quest with. Drink half a cup and a quarter cup water right now. I don't even, this is all the water I've got with me right now. It's not even, like, maybe that's a cup? Yeah, why didn't they just say eighth cup though? That's what I wanna know. Bro, homie, like, immediately started murking these poor Aptonauts. Hello, Naj, I see that you're new. Marbled beef? Marbled beef. Crown, I've got marbled beef. Apparently, Aptonauts are cattle. Naj, I think you've got, like, 17k points. You're gonna take forever spamming the high I'm new trying to waste your points through that. Tell you what, uh, after stream today, I'll I'll make a channel. <laughs> I'll make I'll make two channel point rewards. One of them for the uh, for like a small amount of point wasting, and one for like a giga chat amount. All right. And that way you'll be able to waste your points to your heart's content. Sixty nine four twenty point flex. Yeah, that's one of the ones I was gonna do. <clears throat> Gotta do some digging. Where's hi? I'm Naj. Like I said, I'm I'm working on. Uh, I'm having to learn this uh, program for the channel point stuffs. I want to make sure I'm doing it all right. So, like, it'll be a hot minute before I get the other channel point rewards back up. It, it's It's got a learning curve to it, and I haven't fully figured it out. Where are those Hermitor? Are they over at Area 4? You just had to run out of flour at 6am when no store is open? Oof. Uh, did you try not running out of flour? Got him. You used cornstarch as a substitute? Yeah, cornstarch is not a very good substitute for flour. It's just not great at all. Where are the Hermitors? Where are they at? What area are they in? Oh, there's one. Cornbread donuts when? I'ma measure real quick, BRB.
there's a red pearl. Ah, no. Oh. I didn't even know that Hermitor existed. You really trying to hit the Thunderbug? Dog. It's that easy. Bug poison stinger. Great Thunderbugs have poison? What? I didn't think they did. Thought they was just thunder damage. Crustacean robust shell. Ooh, there's a shiny here. Didn't find anything. Okay. Lie to me, game. Bug small legs. Oh, there's another Hermitor. Uh, let's shield bash him. Oh, okay. <laughs> Car view, bug small legs. Okay. Da, 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 da. I think along one of these walls is a mining node. Uh, is it back this way? I think it's back this way. Mystery shiny pieces. Thunderbug. I don't want Thunderbug. I want these mystery shiny pieces. I don't know what they are. I want them. Glue hopper. No, thank you. Isn't it supposed to be glue glopper? Royal rhino. No, thank you. Royal rhino. No, thank you. Save me the trouble, that's fine. <clears throat> Bug small legs, red pearls. Not too bad. You wish you didn't measure it? Why? Oh no. Oh no. What is it, Naj? What'd you find out? Give us the deets. There's measurement jug and cup. Did you use the jug? You use the measurement cup to measure the flour and sugar. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh, homie. Bro, you said you watched the video. <laughs> Yeah, that's why you got batter instead of... <laughs> I didn't even know Calamite was still here until then. <laughs> Calamite was mad, disappointed. Calamite might be raging at you in honor of your teacher. 
Bro. How? How even? The video's not wrong. Yeah, no, I'm... <laughs> what? I... Did you not look at the video, though? Like, were you not watching it? Can I claim my... No, I can't. Okay. You looked. Oh. I've got a headache for your teacher, Naj. You were just using the jug because it's close to the water dispenser. That's not why you use the jug. If it says one quarter cup. Ugh. All right, hold on. Let me, let me switch over to this. So what? what, what, what what's the excuse we got going? What do we got, Nosh? <laughs> You've got no excuse. <laughs> Alright. Well, I'm gonna call it for today. <laughs> All right, we're, we're going to take this over to Discord. I'm going to go ahead and close the stream. I got to get off here. All right, you guys take it easy. Have a good day. I love you all. <laughs>